Welcome back to the news at 5. It's currently 45 past 3.32. Today's news is... Well, it's news to me. The headlines today are... Now what? What now? Who's next? What's this? What does it do? How did we get here? What do you want from me now? Breaking news! The breaking news just in. Broke. Moving on to the general news and current affairs, I'm now passing the mic to Nigel, who is currently visiting the Fledgeworth Science Laboratory. Over to you, Nigel. Thank you, Boris. I'm not actually in London. I really am hidden away undercover in the attic of the Fledgwick Science Laboratory, where they're doing tests to see whether wearing headphones for long periods of time affects your hearing. Interesting. I thought you were in Fledgling. While you're there, could you tell us about the new model of earpiece they're conducting the tests with? Personally, I think it's all rubbish. I've been using this earpiece for 10 years now, and it hasn't had the slightest effect on my hearing. That was Nigel, at the Fledgwink Laboratory. Sorry, could you repeat the question, please? What? Huh? Sorry? Hey! Excuse me? Could you repeat, please? Excuse me? I said, could you repeat, please? No, sorry. You asked me to repeat. I repeated, excuse me. Oh, sorry. I meant to ask you to repeat the question. Sorry? No, no, not, not that one either. Ah, never mind. Uh, okay... Moving on to the travel news. Excuse me? Hi, I'm some famous rich dude, and I've been using my nose for almost 25 years, smelling the good, the bad, and the ugly, and the ugly. I think it's safe to say I'm an expert in the art of using my nose. That's why I always use scent perfume. Skin scent perfume comes in many different fragrances, such as the floral scented Birmingham dandelion for women. The soft oriental Mumbai mud for men. Fresh fish, freshness for everyone, with its famous aquatic notes. And finally, the forest fire for fans of the mossy woods fragrance. But wait, there's more. For an unlimited time only, you can benefit from scent special buy one get none free offer. So what are you waiting for? Christmas? Buy Skent Perfume at a perfume shop near you. Sorry Nigel, I think we've got a problem with the line. What? <laughs> I think we've got a problem with Nigel. You think so? What? Oh, I'll just do the travel news. No, okay. Those experiencing delays on the underground may be pleased to find that Gail Roney, Head of Transport, has issued a statement regarding the slow start after the recent tube strikes. Here it is. That's an excellent question, actually. I'm glad you asked. You see, the problem is down to driver transport, really. Sometimes it can be hard to get the tube driver to the tube station where he works in order for him to drive the tube and get people to work. And that's because, well, if the tube driver takes the tube down the tube to get to the tube station in order to drive the tube and get people to work, it can be hard for the tube driver to take the night tube down the tube to the tube station where it works in order to drive the tube and resume normal tube service. As a result, we need a tube driver to drive the tube driver down the tube to the tube in order for him to drive the tube and get people to work. That was Gail Roney, Head of Transport. And now, onto the weather, with Jeremy Not Corbin. Or Clarkson, for that matter. Jeremy? Thank you, Boris. Well, you join me over here in, uh... Sorry, I wasn't quite paying attention to where I was. Um, although, it's summertime, and the coastline is devoid of Brits, which leads me to assume that we could be... A 
anywhere along the British coastline, to be fair, which doesn't narrow it down very much. But anyway, moving on to the weather. Uh, in the coming week, uh, we should expect a continuation in the recent trend of summer, beautiful skies and uh, very high temperatures. Um, starting over down in southeastern England, uh, near London, you should expect some especially high temperatures down there and very, very clear skies. Um, meanwhile, over in Portsmouth, you could expect perhaps a gentle breeze at most. Um, well, uh, oh, I Regarding the recent kidnapping of the local police sketch artist, witness witnesses have been able to give a description of the culprit. The facial composite is appearing on screen. We apologise for its poor quality. The police sketch artist, well, the police sketch artist was busy, and that was the news. No longer news to me.